One of the pieces that I'm currently researching right now and looking into extensively is the change that took place in the African American community between the 1970s and our current situation today in regards to increased number of homicides, increased incarceration rates and all of these things that I'm looking at. And one of the things that I see that is a continual variable that is not present today that was present in the 60s and the 70s is that you had the black family. And when you had the destruction of the family and the breakup of the family, you continue to see increased incarceration rates, increased homicide rates, black on black crime. But when you had those families intact, you know, we had a common bond, you had a man, you had a woman, and it took two people to make them, and it takes a minimum two people to raise them. And so I think that that contributes a lot to the things that we see going on today because the family unit is not as intact. And even when it is, you know, we don't continue to stand for the things that the family used to. So I'm hoping that we will be able to come together and I can continue to research and have data to, 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 to make it valid and reliable in regards to my policies on how much important the family actually makes.